So the, the Medrash comes along and it teaches us the whole story. Abraham got thrown into the furnace. Without the Medrash, we would have never known this whole story how Abraham got thrown into the furnace. But then comes Abraham leaving his home, Lech Lecha, this Pusparsha, he's willing to go out there into the world because Hashem told him so. The Torah talks about what's greater, the fact that Abraham left his home or the fact that he jumped into a furnace of fire. What's greater? Guys, what do you think is a bigger sacrifice? I would assume if I had a choice, Hashem says, leave your home, or your other option is to jump into the fire. Which one would you say is worse? I would think that jumping in the fire is a bigger sacrifice than to go and leave your house. And yet the Torah doesn't make so much of an emphasis or of a big deal about the fact that Avraham was willing to jump into the fire. That's a medrash. The fact that the Torah says Ur Kazdim, and we have to learn it out from a medrash. Without the medrash, I wouldn't have even known that Avraham was thrown into a fire, that Avraham was willing to sanctify God's name and willing to, uh, to risk his life to sanctify Hashem's name. So then, why does Hashem talk about it in the Torah? And the answer is, because to Hashem, to die for Him, is a Kiddush Hashem, and it's great, and you're going to be rewarded greatly for it. To sacrifice your life could be one second, but to live your life for Hashem is a whole lifetime. And to make a Kiddush Hashem every single step along the way is much greater in God's eyes. So the Hashem talks about Lech Lecha, how Abraham left his home, and he puts more of an emphasis on that, more than he talks about the fact that Abraham jumped into a fire. To us, it's about living for Hashem. It's not just about dying for Hashem. To live your life for God every single second and every single opportunity that comes your way to do a Kiddush Hashem, and like I explained to you, it's not about how people view us in the public, but how we behave in the private. When we're, in, in seclu- we're secluded, no one watching us, and we realize and we give recognition to Hashem, that's living your life for Hashem. And Hashem says, for that I will, I will praise, for that I'm going to talk about, that I'm going to write in the Torah, how Lech Lecha, Abraham leaves his home, that will make it to the headlines. But the fact that Abraham you know, jumped into the fire, that's amazing, that's beautiful, but that's dying. That's maybe sacrificing maybe one second, but the sacrifice every second of your life is so much more greater.